Hi guys, it's Brendan here and thanks for tuning in to my series on how to make instant impact in your training programs or the programs of your clients and athletes. And what I'm going to talk about in this video is the concept of variety in training. And a lot of the time we tend to both do as athletes or, or, or fitness enthusiasts or prescribe as coaches, we tend to prescribe the things that we like in our training. We like coaching squats so everyone gets squats. We like coaching overhead lifts or power cleans so everybody gets cleans. And that's that's not the right way to approach it. We've got to think about what does our athlete need and what do they really enjoy and finding a balance of those two variables there. Balancing the need to do with what they like to do or they enjoy to do. And what the goal of our programs is as well. Because we're not here to make create monster squatters that, that just squat for the sake of squatting, unless it, we're training powerlifters. We're training athletes, we're training the general public. They need skills to function in life or in sport. And we do that by having variety in the training programmes. And one of my mentors, Vern Gambetta, he talks about this concept of we're trying to develop adaptable individuals not adapted individuals. And if all we ever do is squat, bench, deadlift and row, then we're creating very adapted people. They're adapted to those four things. But what we need are people who can solve problems and skills. And we do that by giving them variety in training. And all of your exercises need to have progressions and regressions and challenges within them. Um, so if it's hopping over a hurdle and landing, that's a challenge. We've got to give them something to solve a problem. And when they've solved that, we can give them the next problem, which is maybe hopping backwards or hopping sideways. And really being creative with that. So variety is key, guys. And in line with the less is more principle, less is more, sorry, principle, what we'll probably find is that if we're stripping back some of the work that we're giving out here, we might have a little bit more room to play with to introduce some different exercise, some variety there. And um, you can do it through, in, within the same session, introduce a little bit more variety in your one or seven, 60 to 75 minute session, or you can do it session by session, or you can do it week by week or fortnight by fortnight. The key thing is that you're thinking about introducing more variety into your programs, and that will give you instant impact right away.